Queen really exhausted by Sussex. Prince Harry's legal fights bombshell made Palace in chaos. Royal fans are in despair over Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's legal battles. This comes after Prince Harry began suing the Daily Mail's publisher for libel. Twitter account Royalty, which comments on the royal family, said they were exhausted. They wrote, Will I still be someone people follow for my thoughts on the royals and the press if I stop commenting on the Sussex's legal battles with media? Because honestly, I'm just exhausted by it at this point. The royal commentator added, I am just finding their press drama to be so repetitive and frustrating that I don't think I have anything new to say about it. Another Twitter user, Beth, agreed, writing, I would love to hear your thoughts on the regal royals. I'm fine not getting anything on the failures and wannabes. It truly is exhausting. Luna B added, yes prefer to focus on the Queen and senior working royals. Markle's constant need to stay relevant is annoying and find myself scrolling past tweets and do not click on the articles anymore. An account called The Royal Watcher replied, writing, I think we're all exhausted and couldn't blame you one bit for stopping. Another, nicknamed Queen Catherine added, I agree, it's getting exhausting. The Duke of Sussex launched legal action against Associated Newspapers in the High Court on Wednesday afternoon. It is not yet clear which of the group's papers is being sued by Prince Harry, nor which article the complaint relates to. Prince Harry's office confirmed to ITV News that legal proceedings have begun. A source said, the Duke has filed a complaint against Associated Newspapers Limited. Last year, the Duchess of Sussex won a legal battle against Associated Newspapers after they published a letter she had written to her father Thomas Markle. Prince Harry is also currently involved in a legal battle with the Home Office over his security arrangements when he is in the UK. The 37-year-old royal applied for police protection in January 2020 when he visited the UK, offering to pay for it personally, but said the offer was dismissed. A legal representative for the prince said that he and his family are unable to return home as a result of Harry's inherited security risk. Prince Harry has insisted that the UK will always be his home as his legal claim against the Home Office was brought to the High Court this morning. The Duke of Sussex has applied for a judicial review of a Home Office decision not to allow him to personally pay for police protection for himself and his family when they are in the UK, a legal representative has said. He wants to bring his children to visit from the US, but he and his family are unable to return to his home because it is too dangerous, a legal representative previously said. It is thought to be the first time a member of the royal family has brought a case against Her Majesty's government. Prince Harry, who is not in court this morning, wants to fund the security himself instead of asking taxpayers to foot the bill. Introducing the case this morning, Shahid Fatima QC, for the Duke, said, This claim is about the fact that the claimant does not feel safe when he is in the UK given the security arrangement supplied to him in June 2021 and will continue to be applied to him. She continued, It goes without saying that he does want to come back to see family and friends and to continue to support the charities that are so close to his heart. Most of all, this is and always will be, his home. Mr Justice Swift said today's proceedings were not the main hearing of the Duke's claim and that it would focus on which parts of the court documents will remain private and which will be made public. At the preliminary hearing, the court heard an application by both sides for some parts of the court documents in the case to be kept private. The judge said part of Friday's hearing would be heard in private, adding that if it was not it would destroy the purposes of the application before I've had the opportunity to decide whether it should succeed or fail.